this is the Making Noise podcast. I'm kind of curious when when you started getting into the new music um, community and stuff like that, what was something, whether it was like, I don't know, like playing at a cafe or, you know, uh, playing, uh, collaborating or something, but what was something about it that you like really surprised you in a good way where you're like, oh my God, this is, I haven't had this. This is so interesting. I'm so glad I'm here. <laughs> um, the one that like in terms of like commissioning new music, you mean, or? or? Yeah, what, whatever, whatever comes to mind, really. Yeah. The one thing that comes to mind was um, a commission. So with my, my duo, l and Duo, uh, we've done a little less this last year, just, you know, like circumstances and things, but it's still one of my favorite ensembles that um, I've had the pleasure of playing with that I've, that I've made. So we did a commission by a composer named Jay Dardarian, who's uh, on the West Coast, I think doing more like computer programming things than, than composing these days, but he's an incredible composer. And because I have this percussion background and my dual partner um, is really facile at piano, she's a fantastic pianist, we like really wanted a chance to kind of like be a little bendy and flexible on what instruments we're playing, not just strictly me on piano and her on marimba. And so he totally took us to task on that offer and wrote this incredible piece uh, called Ludic Loops that um, it was in like five different interludes, so five different little movements. And the entire piece was a, an anagram. And we start on our own instruments, and then we move to like four hands and eventually make our way to each other's instruments. And like four, so we like kind of work our way around the whole instrumentation <sighs> and end up back on our, our own instruments by the end. And oh my God, it was a trip. And the music itself was just so fun and like, rhythmically aggressive and right down my alley. So it was <laughs> great. <laughs> That's cool. I love the uh, the theatrical element of that too. Totally. Yeah. It was a hoot. <laughs> it, it totally, it gives, stuff like that is definitely something I don't think audiences will forget, you know? Yeah. Like that's that's a pretty powerful performance where the performers are just jamming out and then gradually transitioning between their parts and, you I, know, and. I think we blew like a few people's minds. Like eventually they get the idea like, oh, okay. So they're moving around. But like the first time that one of us moved, it's like, what's, <laughs> what's going on? Like when I go to the marimba, like what? She can play marimba? And of course I like, yeah, worked really hard to get my chops back up. To <laughs> <do> that. <laughs> I think another one that comes to mind was uh, a commission by Stephen Snowden that we did. That was like a huge, long story of a process to make that um, event come to life, where like we planned this entire event around his the premiere of his new piece that was called um, 25 Million Candles. So it was inspired by the Wrigley Building downtown in Chicago. And so we got to premiere it like in the plaza right in front of the Wrigley Building. And like it got lit up for the night from the outside, like exactly as we started to play the premiere. It was like, it was so, so sweet. Oh my God, that is amazing. Those are the kind of things that like, yeah, <sighs> unique to uh, this little niche in the music world. That is, I am so excited to hear that you got to do that. And I wasn't even there or anything. Like, that's just cool. <laughs> <laughs> That, that's really interesting. Um, yeah, where is Wrigley Field? Not Wrigley Field. So that is in, um, like, jeez, uh, Lincoln Park, uh -huh. Wrigley Field. So it's, like, the lakefront and north of downtown. Um, and then the Wrigley Building, named after the same guy, is, uh, like, right by the river in the, lake, in the lakefront. So it's mm. on the Magnificent Mile. Okay, downtown, okay. Chicago, yeah. Gotcha. Um, I have something I'm kind of curious about right now. I need to take a look real quick. Okay. Um, uh, so, <laughs> damn. You mentioned New Music Gathering. Um, oh, yeah. Which one did you go to? I The first one I went to was in Baltimore, mm -hmm. Peabody. And then I went to BGSU, and then is there only two that I've been to? Oh my gosh, I've there's been I've kind of forgotten. I feel like there was a third one that I went to, but I wouldn't remember where it was. <laughs> I'm trying to because I know they do it in different locations. Did they do it in Arizona? Oh gosh, 
I don't remember. They had Boston, but I've definitely been mm. to the first one I went to was in Baltimore. And then the one we performed at was at, um, in BG at BGSU. Um, I think I was in the composer's performer speed dating and I got one of your business cards. No, I swear, I swear oh. to God, that's what I was just looking for. Cause I think, I think I have it somewhere. <laughs> that's incredible. <laughs> were, were you in that? Absolutely. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Laurel, Laurel actually just sent me some of the business cards that we'd had. Just like, I thought you like, I thought these would be interesting to you. <laughs> You've seen all these. It's like, Oh, what a like, and like, there's so many people that I now like have a regular relationship with that I met during the speed dating that like it's speed dating. So you don't remember every face that you see. Yeah, like, man, that's, that's a point for business cards. Oh, that's so fun. I know I have it too. I have, I have a bunch of business <laughs> cards just like right over here for that for people. But um, yeah, because when you mentioned New Music Gathering and then you mentioned Jay Darden, uh, I met Jay at the BGSU one. Oh, man, that's, I didn't even get to meet him in person there. That's oh, funny. Really? Yeah, true story. <laughs> oh, I miss New Music Gathering. I so hope that it's in person in August. Yeah, that was a that was a really cool experience. I mean, it was just a, a plethora of all kinds of different presentations and performances and discussions and like experiences. It's magical. It's yeah, it's such a great thing that they've created. I'm so grateful for it. <laughs> yeah, and it's so funny too to think like I I'm, I think I may have been at that talk where they did the commissioning discussion. No way. I, I'm pretty sure I was. And like to think that we were there at the same time. Like. Oh my God.